hello everybody welcome back to my youtube channel so today i'm going to show you how to make your own strip lash um also don't mind my nails i need to fill in <laughs> so both of these came in a lash extensions kit so they give you the individual pre-made fans which you would never use on a natural human lash just a disclaimer the base is very thick so that would cause issues but this has nothing to do with the video so practice lash is the closest thing you can get to a human lash but so what we're doing here is we're going to be gluing the individual lashes on top of the practice lashes and we're pretty much going to glue it to the band itself i also wanted to mention that the individual lashes i'm using in this video are one size so you're i'm not going to have a, a you know a totally um different style where i'm doing it where it could be short on the inner corner and it goes out longer all the way out to the outer corner so with that being said you could create any type of lash style you want whether you want it to be wispy you know a dramatic mink look whatever you want you can do it you would use individual lashes like these or what you could do as an alternative if you just wanted to mess around with it you could cut a strip lash that you already have right and you could create your own kind of desired look with it so if you have these super wispy crazy lashes and you want to mix them up you can always do that too i'm using sky glue which is a lash extension glue so what i'm going to do is um dot it down but i forgot to shake it so i'm gonna shake it and then put a dot down so I'm using a curved lash extension tweezer. So what we're gonna do next is take the individual cluster lash out of the lash case. Okay, so now we're gonna take that individual lash, dip it in the glue, and we're gonna wipe off any excess glue because we obviously don't need that there. And now, I'm going to apply it to the outer corner to the lash band itself. There we go. So we're going to move on to the second lash. And remember to be applying this to the lash band, not the lash itself. Then we're going to move on to the third lash, and then the fourth lash, okay, and I'm going to use the fan at this point so that the glue could dry down faster. All right, so at this point, I'm going to speed up the process.
I'm gonna take a spoolie and just brush it and this is how your lash ends up looking very pretty we're gonna do a cool lash trick and we're just gonna go crazy with it So I'm just going to continue doing the other lash and I'm going to speed through it.
now it should be done. Alright, so I'm just going to brush it with a spoolie. Just to make sure the hairs are all nice and intact and looks great. Okay, so we are all finished with the lashes. Um, unfortunately, I got some glue all over this area, but that happens sometimes because it just gets really messy. But these are how the lashes look, and I think they're so pretty. But it'd be even nicer if you had, like, all the different sizes, like, not a whole one size kind of thing, unless that's your thing. But I'm gonna just fluff them up and make them look a little bit more natural. So this is the finished look, bring it up close a bit so you can see what it looks like. And there you go, you got your own strip lashes. So this is actually how the lash looks when you take it off of the plastic um, lash holder. I'll flip it around for you guys. So um, I just wanted to show you that. I hope you really enjoyed this video and please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Thank you so much for watching.